We're going to create a nice new oil painting today, aren't we, buddy? Let's get started. First things first, we want to grab our dark paint to be the background. Just thinking about composition. Grab our Galkid medium. Get our brush ready and get ready. Now making the first marks, we're just putting paint on to cover the canvas. We'll do a slightly off-white and start working on the composition, thinking about values. Get a color that's close to the final result and push the values first with the relative color. Scrape off some of the excess paint so we can keep working without having to wait for it to dry. Once we ghost in a semi-accurate backdrop, we get our first layer kind of accurate and then we start going for true accuracy and true value. And it's all about going back and forth between lights and darks, lights and darks, building it up, blending it together. Here I'm flicking on some excess paint to have plenty of paint to work with, but also to soften some edges and build up again the correct value. At this point, we're also pushing the colors ever so slightly, asking ourselves if it needs more red, yellow, or blue. Constantly thinking about value and blending the edges. Whatever marks we make, we want to be blending the edges, blending it into everything else. Everything on the canvas needs to be unified. So use any method you can think of. Here we're using some paper towels to lift up some paint, but also uh, knowing that underneath is white, we lighten up the value a little bit. Now we're going into the brightest brights and we have our full range. We have our darkest dark spots and we have our lightest lights. And again, blend those edges. It makes it feel more real. Just light shapes that turn into the dark shapes. We're turning form. And we turn it by blending the edges. We have lost edges, which is a light into a dark on the same subject. And then when there's a shift, we have soft edges. So they're, they're still present when, say, one cloud form ends and the other is farther in the background when that begins. Pushing the lights to get as bright as possible because we want a full value range. The full value range that's possible to achieve realism is the, the brightest we can go is white. Titanium white is what I'm using in this one and the darkest we can go is black and I'm using ivory black for this. So it's a, a constant loop of these thoughts, thinking mostly about value, then about color, and then about edge and proportion. and unifying the entire painting while also noting 
the differences in form. Trying to get the form accurate while still feeling uh, harmonized with the whole. And we're getting into the fine brush, uh, two round brush on the detail work. We want the focal point to stand out and be as accurate as possible. And there you have it.